People are wanting to spend their Saturdays out enjoying wine at a local vineyard, but this summer is going to look a little different at most area wineries. We check in this morning with the Valley Today's Abby Furchner, who has talked to some local business owners, and uh, she joins us live from a vineyard this morning. Good morning, Abby. Good morning, Lisa. It was definitely not the May that many wineries were hoping for. I know a lot of them weren't able to open their doors yet, but June is looking like the new month that they are going to be opening. I know Dakota Vines Vineyard and Winery were at this morning. They're going to be opening June 4th. But I talked to many wineries around the area, and they said that for many of them, it was difficult to make this decision and decide if and when they should open. But another one we can expect to open here soon is Bear Creek Winery. They're going to be opening up here uh, on June 1st. Their tasting room is going to be opening up on June 1st. These will be private tastings, and they will accept six groups, up to 10 people in each. The tastings can be any day of the week, so just pick your day and they will be an hour and a half long. Now, the owners, when I talked to them, they told me that the reason why they went with the private tastings for right now, instead of just opening up the entire winery, is because they're hoping to be able to control the environment a little bit more and make sure that everyone is staying safe while enjoying that wine out on the patio. But also, if you're not quite comfortable yet going to their winery, they're hoping to roll out a plan here soon where you can do no contact delivery or curbside pickup as well. They're hoping to have that set in June on June 1st, too. So get your wine glasses ready because the wineries are going to be opening up here in the area. We'll just have to wait a couple more weeks to do so. Some big changes, but very doable. Abby Furchner reporting live for us. Thank you.